The Life of Edgar Allan Poe American author Edgar Allan Poe was born in 1809 in Boston, Massachusetts. Edgar's mother died when he was two years old. His father died shortly after. With no parents to care for him, young Edgar moved to Richmond, Virginia to be raised by the Allen family. As a young boy, Edgar loved to spend his days writing. He also enjoyed reading poetry and swimming. When he was old enough, Edgar entered the University of Virginia to study languages. He dropped out after one year. In 1827, Edgar enlisted in the U.S. Army. Two years later, he started taking classes at the U.S. Military Academy at West Point. Edgar often skipped class and earned poor grades. It was not long before he was kicked out of school. With nowhere else to turn, Edgar moved in with his aunt in Baltimore, Maryland. He made the decision to focus on what he loved most, writing. After getting a job with a magazine in Richmond, Edgar settled down and married his cousin, Virginia Clem. Over the next several years, Edgar wrote many poems and short stories. In 1845, Edgar's poem, The Raven, was published in a New York newspaper. It was an instant success. Edgar only made a few dollars for the poem, but he became known around the world as a talented writer. Two years after the success of The Raven, Edgar's wife passed away. This tragic event plunged Edgar into a downward spiral. Edgar spent the last years of his life poor, drunk, and sick. In 1849, he was found delirious on the streets of Baltimore, Maryland. He died a few days later. Edgar Allan Poe remains one of America's most famous writers. His dark and mysterious poems and stories continue to haunt readers of all ages.